Madam President, EU's failure to sign a deal with Ukraine. It's described as the worst blow in the history of the European Union. Now, what went wrong? It's not a failure of European Union. It's a failure of Ukraine. And not Ukraine, even Ukrainian leadership to sign the agreement. And I think opposite, the Vilnius summit showed very clearly that Ukraine and today's leadership is politically and personally not ready at all to go deeper into European integration process and practically they made all Ukraine their personal hostage for their own interests. And opposite, we are seeing wake up of Ukrainian people. Now, there are those who believe that you didn't make it worth Ukraine's while to cut its umbilical cord from Russia. That is, you didn't offer enough. Europe is not about buying and offering. Europe about helping the countries to make their own decision, free, without pressure, and on their own. So today's Ukrainian leadership is not capable to make this decision, but Ukrainian people are every day themselves are making this decision. You're coming to the end of uh, your presidency of the EU. What is your feeling about it? Oh, a very good feeling. <laughs> I can joke that. Of course, we were preparing a lot and uh, practically two years uh, it took for us to, to be prepared. And also we are in pre-election, European pre-election uh, season. So a lot of uh, practically uh, job was pushed to us uh, not to leave it for the next uh, half a year because everybody will be more or less uh, busy with elections. But of course now it is a relief that we managed, it was not so bad, somebody says even very good, but it's not up to me to say that. And uh, finally we only two weeks and uh, we giving it to the Greek presidents. Madam President, thank you. Thank you.